Hey YouTube, this is Kflin300 here, and I've been having a real problem with MC Patcher and how much it sucks. So I decided I was going to go find something that would be a lot better, and what do you know, there's something that's ten times better, and it's barely even talked about. It's called Optifine, and oh my gosh, what a difference. It's a, it's It makes your Minecraft run like two times faster. I went from being on normal uh, view and like, well, like fast FPS and uh, fast setting to like, I can go on fancy and far and balance and it's really, really helpful. And I can load any like HD texture pack that I want and it runs perfectly. Plus, this works if you have already modded your Minecraft. I hated MC Patcher because I had a bunch of mods and it didn't work for it. So I always had these horrible, horrible like like glitches where I couldn't even see the water. It would be like see-through or there wouldn't even be half the blocks. So here's what you got to do to get this and it's really easy. Uh, just click the link in the description and you'll get the Minecraft forms. And it's just this uh, Optifine page, and it's it's oh my gosh! There's all these different uh, ones that you can get, but I would just go with the standard one right here and click the second download, and it'll take you to Add Fly, and you just click like Skip Add, and it'll be right here, and then download it, and you'll get a zip file and just open up the zip file and you'll get this Optifine. So once you got this Optifine, it's really easy. It's not hard at all. It's just like downloading a mod for uh, uh, any other, like too many mods. It's pretty easy. Let me open a new window. So once you're in here, you're, in, you're under your iMac, library, application support, and Minecraft. So you're in your Minecraft folder, go to bin, and your Minecraft.jar folder. If you don't have a .jar folder, um, you can look at some of my other videos. It tells you how to change it. It's pretty simple, and yeah. So once you're in here, just literally click and drag all these over to here, and you're done. Uh, once you're done, like, once you're done copying and replace all the files that need to be replaced uh, you can get all these extra options once you're in Minecraft and if you have a texture pack like an HD texture pack that you want to load open up the zip file into a folder and actually drag your Minecraft app from your desktop into the folder and once it's in the folder just exit out and you can start up Minecraft and I have LB Photo Realism as my uh, uh, texture pack that I wanted to use. And I only have it 64 times 64. You can get 256, which is really, really high resolution. But uh, I, I'm just using this lower one because I didn't really feel like downloading the higher one. So once you're in here, look, it's already changed it and you actually do get a lot more options once you're in the game so I'm gonna go to multiplayer and go on my server and uh... Let me, and it's already loaded everything um... it's pretty cool like and I'll show you my mods are on here I have the zombie mod pack activated and it's an HD texture pack as you can tell this uh... the lava looks sweet um, I can probably show you some water. Where's some water? Uh, here's some water. See, it's really, really helpful. And the extra options that you have is just click options, video settings, and you have all these different options that you can pick from. And if you go onto the forum page, it'll tell you exactly what each one is. But, oh my gosh, I can't believe this isn't like more talked about than MC Patcher because how annoying is MC Patcher? I mean, really. So, uh, have fun with this. I know you guys will. Just, uh, pretty much don't 
like screw up and download the wrong files that would be bad so thanks for watching i hope you have a fun time with your new texture packs and options uh subscribe and like